All right, so uh, we're going to go ahead and take a look at uh, our monthly budget, if that works with you. Okay. All right, so let's see what's in there. iTunes? What's that? <laughs> that's probably you. You know I don't ever... What? I think that's that. Of Owl City song, Fireflies. Well, whose idea was that? Yeah. Certainly wasn't mine. Uh-huh. All right. Walmart. What'd you buy at Walmart? Gosh, I don't think I can. I don't remember. Right. But I, it's only $5. Right. Okay. Well, there's three more charges on here for Walmart. What'd you do there? Well, like this one is groceries and that one is like diapers. What do you want your kids to go without diapers? Don't we have cloth diapers? Gosh. And then raise our water bill? I don't I'm think I'm just so. saying. All right. Another Walmart. Another grocery store. Cold Stone. Come on. How much ice cream do you need to eat? Hey, you're the... the ice cream aficionado. You're the one that's always eating ice cream. Walmart? How many times do you go to Walmart every month? You gotta stay away from that place. Fine, Brad. Why don't you do grocery shopping? Domino's Pizza? Yeah. Well, That's, that's like I, the second one. Yeah, I wonder whose idea pizza is every night Look, when to ask me for pizza. If you're in charge of cooking, then you should talk me out of pizza. The Asian Grocery Store? Hancock Fabrics? More Apple iTunes? I know that one wasn't me. Oh yeah? Well how about all the ebooks you're downloading off the Kindle? Ugh, whatever. Yeah, right, exactly. <laughs> like five of those a month. Look, the bottom line is I think we both spend money on stuff that we probably really don't need. Okay. As long as you put both in that statement. Alright. I'm I'm at fault too. I'm at fault too. You know if we save like fifty dollars a month, even at eight percent interest rate from now until we're seventy, we'd have like a hundred and fifty five thousand dollars saved up. I don't know. I think maybe uh, at age seventy that's like a long way from now. And $155,000 is not going to be that much money. Oh, yeah? Well, what if we actually saved a real amount, like, say, $100 a month, right? Yeah, try $310,000. All right. Well, I mean, look, it's either buy a bunch of ice cream and stuff now and enjoy the good life or have $300,000. I mean, even adjusted for inflation, $0 is still $0 in 40 years. It's true. How's your budgetary planning going? Is your conversation this nice? Look, this isn't about marriage counseling. This is just about objective viewing of the facts. Look, numbers don't lie. People do. So if you need help looking at your budget, give us a call, and we'll comb through the numbers, and I bet we could find a place for you to save. Look, even at $155,000, you adjust that for inflation, it's still going to be more than the $0 that you have saved up right now. Don't wait until your 40s or 50s to start saving for retirement. Because if you do, chances are that you're going to have to save a whole lot more than $50 a month. Well, you can still do like fun things every now and then. And $50 a month isn't really that much. No, that's true. It's within reason. Look, planning a budget isn't about cutting out everything and living like a monk. It's really just about being realistic about what you spend. Allotting money to certain things. Right, and setting a budget. So every month we have a budget for $25 for entertainment and $50 for discretionary. So it's really not spending money that's bad, it's spending more money than you've allotted. Right. All right. So thanks for joining us at Magnum Opus Financial. Don't forget the phone number is located right above here where we're talking. And if you have other questions, feel free to read all the rest of the article that's on this page and give us a call. Thanks so much for choosing us and have a great day.